Lunchbox Bunch. You may remember the Lunchbox Bunch. It's a bit we did way back many years ago many, on this channel. Many, many years ago. But then we entered a, uh, a cornhole uh, tournament and we were traveling the country oh. playing cornhole. And then we got stuck in uh, the Maldives. Yeah. We yeah. We quarantine. We got locked down there. So we've been in the, the Maldives. But how, how have you been doing the videos in a sense? It's, it's, the story isn't holding. No, I, I did them all in advance. Oh, that was like, I banked up a whole bunch. That's you right. know, you just, so you just like made videos where you're like, that new Star Wars movie is gonna stink because there's too many women in it. Yeah, because you knew that was gonna happen anyway. It's gone. It's Zach, gone woke. Zack Snyder. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so he, knew, he knew what the future was gonna be like anyway. It was exactly, ridiculous. exactly. Yeah. And you know, like well, I stood outside movie theaters that were closed for the pandemic and said, today we're here seeing. Cruella, and then I guessed. Yeah, you just figured that they would make a movie about Cruella. Yeah, I just guessed. You just guessed, you just guessed what the movie was going to be like. And, right, yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it didn't work out. We were like, Tom Brokaw was torn apart by wolves today. Yeah, or the. But you had to cover your bases because you didn't know. Yeah, and then, fun. you know, there was the time I was standing outside the movie theater and I was like, today we're here to review Dweebs, Geeks, and Weirdos, the movie based on the hit board game. And then it turns out they, they never made they didn't that do movie. It, yeah, so. The Stretch Armstrong movie. The stretch, yeah, that one. Yeah. yeah. So well, well, we're back. We're back. We're here to talk we lunchboxes. Things to do, which, you know, we haven't done on the lunchbox bunch. We never yeah. did this before because it's an un, it's an unboxing. An unboxing. So normally the lunchbox. Normally the thumbnail. Box. Normally the thumbnail for our videos is a close up of the lunchboxes, but we can't do that because it would spoil the unboxing. So you're gonna put like so, unboxing. I think we should. Marks. I think we should pose like right now for right. the thumbnail, like right. like. That'll be the that's, thumbnail. That's the thumbnail. And if you saw that and clicked on here, now you've just peeked behind the curtain. You saw it happen. So, but we're gonna open this. This was sent to me by one of our viewers, one of our Patreon um, patrons, Lisa Soares. Good old Lisa Soares. Now sent she's me this. solely a Patreon because of the lunchboxes, right? Not because of the other content you post. Um. I, I don't believe she... I, let's, let's be realistic. About 90% of your Patreons are because of metal lunchboxes. Yeah, boxes. yeah. Most... Uh, and remember, plastic lunchboxes suck. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Especially not someone with cinema in their name. You know. Mm -hmm. So. There you oh, go. Oh, and also, we got a new backdrop, too. Because yeah. we're in the Casa da Dave. And yeah. now so, I have... You gotta peek into my lunchbox collection behind me. We're not gonna show you the whole wall. Yeah. It actually goes up about how many feet you think that goes up there? Uh seven hundred feet. Seven hundred feet. And it's all lunchboxes all the way to the top. So. It's actually a lie. There are no lunchboxes. This is all a green screen. It's a green screen, which is amazing because I'm wearing a I actually have no torso. This is yeah. this isn't even a shirt. This is the green screen knocking right, out of my right, there's exactly. nothing here. Yeah. yeah, it's impressive. Yeah, I'm just uh, I'm like like the it's a head and floating arms. <laughs> Should we should we open this because we should, well, I think we're scaring away. Everyone's like, yeah. I haven't seen a lunchbox bunch with these guys in two years. We're gonna need. Uh, and we're getting. Yeah, we're, you know what? You need something to open it, right? Yeah, we so need I have something. My, my ever my ever faithful loving paprika. Oh, the, paprika. The paprika! The pair of scissors. Uh, it's no rosemary. Rosemary the scissors. Rosemary so. the scissors. Yeah. So careful, don't cut your fingers off on the live TV. I don't want to. Yeah. What do you think's in there? Do you think it's a head? I think, uh, I'm Could guessing. If there is a human head in here and we are doing this live. I'm guessing it's lunch boxes. For a treat. But maybe there's a head in one of the lunch boxes. You never know, you never know what's in the lunch box. Maybe there's a Do you know what lunch box it is? Uh, you have an idea. I have an idea. Right. I have an idea. So. I hope it's topical. Whatever it is. There you go. Bye bye, paprika. Here we go. Oh. All right, first one. Multiple it's, lunchboxes. It's well well wrapped in bubble tape. Bubbles. Bubble wrap, not bubble tape. Bubble tape is a gum. Bubble tape is a gum. All right, it is an Irwin Allen property Ooh. from the 70s. Voyage 
to the bottom of the sea. That's a good one. Voyage to the bottom of the sea. That's exciting. Yeah. Look at that. I like that octopus on there. He yeah, look at him. Pissed. He's an angry octopus. And then there's a callback to the octopus on the other side. Too. Yeah, That's I think, exciting. is that the same picture? The octopus looks the, exactly the same on the top. The octopus is there again. He was obviously the star of the show. Yeah. Look, he's grabbing a whole ship there. Yeah. He's like, I got your whole little escape pod in my big tentacle. Wow. Look, he's on this side, too. They're looking at him on the street. That octopus is everywhere. Look, the, the people in the show are only featured on the one side. Right? Yeah, the, the stars of the show were on one side. And with the back of the one guy's head, you don't even see. I, I, I never watched this show. Did you ever watch I, 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 the I've never seen Voyage to the Bottom of the Sea. I liked um, Lost in Space. Yeah. And you know... Who, was, who was in that? Who was in... I'm not sure who the star of Voyage well, to the Bottom of the Sea was. We know who the star is. It's the octopus, but... Yeah, apparently the octopus. Now, Mark Goddard, who starred on Lost in Space, used to say that while he was on his cigarette break, he'd go out in between the, the studios or the, the sound stages, and he would see monsters come off of the voyage to the bottom of the sea set, and they were wet, because they are supposed to be sea monsters, and they would get out hair dryers and dry them off, and then the same monster would walk on their set, and they'd shoot the same monster on Lost in Space that afternoon, because Irwin Allen was so cheap. <laughs> there you go, look at that. Octopus, the ship, I believe the ship was called the Sea View. Look at that. It's so funny though. It's like it's like a whole like scene going on because you got he's like pointing. He's like, "There's a GJ octopus," and then you, and then you know, there's a GJ octopus. He's grabbing our ship, and then you flip it over and you're like, "That's the scene." Look at yeah. this GJ octopus. Look at this side, we got a ship amongst some icebergs over there. They're trying that's, to get. That's exciting. What am I? Do we check the inside? We got open this up. Open this so up. A name and or third. Look at these guys. They're they're trying to get that octopus with spears. They're like, "We got spears." That'll handle this octopus. Calamari! Alright, let's open up. There's calamari. Oh. Wait, is there something in there? There is the lid of a thermos. That is... Not a whole thermos. That's new. We've never experienced... Oh, look at that big STP sticker. Stone F Temple Pilots. Is that is that for Stone Temple Pilots or is that a motor oil? That's a That's, motor oil. But yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. So do we have a name in here? It looks like there was a name in there. There's like a sticker in there. It looks like it might have had is a name Scott on Whelan it. Scott Whelan from Stone Temple Pops. Was this his lunchbox? Maybe. Maybe it's Tom Whelan's lunchbox. A different spelling. Yeah. <laughs> he wouldn't have a lunchbox. That Tom, Tom Whelan. His was lunchbox this your, would be like Holly Hobby or was something. It, was this your voyage to the bottom of the sea lunchbox? It wouldn't be that cool. He'd have math. Math. Did Tom Whelan have the math? Let's math get, get him on the old squawk box yeah. and ask him. Like, that's, that's a good one. I'm going to give that definitely uh, eight tentacles up on that. It's I, I would say it's, wow. it's it's a it's so now a, they found this at like at a flea market. Up uh, in, yeah, in, I think in, I think it was a thrift, area, a, thrift a thrift shop. shop. She found this at a thrift shop, and I believe she she's in Rhode Island. Mm -hmm. Let me check the return address here. Yes, I'm not going to her I'm full not, address. If you want to find Lisa, you can find her at Noah, <laughs> but no, it's Rhode Island. Rhode you Island. Give her her PayPal account information. Exactly. Yes. There you go. I'm I'm excited by this one. It's not. It's a little beat up. That's in pretty. It's good a little shape. beat up, but this is pretty. pretty this is shape. pretty good I'm, shape. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna consult the guy because we have right. a guy. I want to see when this one was made. So this is the. We have a guy that has every single metal lunchbox. I'm gonna guess 1960. I'm guessing 68. That would be my guess. All right. Oh, there it is. 67. 67. What was Both so sides are strong, band and bottle equally powerful scenes. One panel is inside looking out. The other up. Wait, one one panel is the inside looking out. The other, the outside looking in. Oh, that's. Oh, so it is. It's like it is like two scenes. You have like, this is from the outside, and then the back scene would be them in the ship. Yeah. Losing their s over the octopus. <laughs> They're like. Gah! GG octopus. He's such a goofy looking octopus too. I love it. Uh, oh, yeah, those angry eyes. He's got, like, seriously. Yeah. That's a good one. That is a good one. So thank you, Lisa. But there's Which, more. In the there is more. There's another lunchbox in this. In this. I like box when they here. the thought, the thought and time that was put into the whole like the scene that's going on there. It's like we have a lunchbox, and then the one side is them, and they're looking inside, and they're looking outside. It's it's great when they do that. I like that. 
Dave, did you ask for topical? I did you say you wanted a topical, topical lunchbox? Is it an Allison Mac Smallville lunchbox? It's not an Allison Mac Smallville lunchbox. What what is in the news today though? What's I got some. Do you want a Delta? Do you want a Delta variant some, lunchbox? Something about that going on. Yeah. Yeah. Well, anything else? What else is going on in the news no, this week? I feel like Fourth of July uh, celebrations all over Fourth America. July is always popular in America. Yeah. Uh, any any once any once beloved. Family comics recently released from prison. Has that happened in the news lately? I think so. I think there was a little bit of that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Hey, 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 what do you got? Hey. What do you got there? Fat Albert. Oh, 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 I saw it peeking out. Fat Ooh, Albert and, and the Cosby, Cosby Kids. kids. <laughs> Look at that. He's going to sing this is, a song This is for in my you. top ten want list of lunchboxes. So you're very lucky. And look at the shape it's in. That is a lucky, lucky one you got. Yeah, look at that. That's, and you know what? I'm sure the value of this has just increased. <laughs> Let's have some fun now with me and all the gang. Where is Bill on the box? Bill, that's Bill on the box. That's Bill right there. There's Bill. Here's, Here's Bill. Bill. He's like, he's like, you hey, guys want something to drink? You know what? I got, I got some hey, drinks for the ladies some here. Juice. <laughs> Uh, what? Why does it taste funny? I put it in a boot. Look, it's in the boot. You can drink it right out of the boot. Out of the boot. Ready? <laughs> there you go. Fat Albert Russell. and the Cosby Kids. 19, I think this one came out in 1973. I say that because it says 1973. And who, who made this one? This is the Thermos This brand? is the Thermos Corporation. Thermos Corporation. It is not embalmed. This embossed. one is embossed. <laughs> it's embalmed. <laughs> It is not give, embalmed. Give Cosby, no embalming fluid. Give Cosby some time. He'll be embalmed yeah. sooner or later. Wow. Yeah, this is uh, oh my a pretty gosh, good that one. Is, that is a really good one. I am jealous. I am. I am. I might. You know what? I might. I might slip you a drink, and when you pass out, that might disappear. You know, your birthday's coming up. <laughs> it is. And I, I seriously <laughs> considered with, with the. With the current climate, I didn't think you'd feel comfortable wearing it, but I seriously considered buying you a brown hornet <laughs> T-shirt. <laughs> yeah, I almost made a Mortimer the, the pen. Yeah, you see on picture pages, I was gonna throw that on a T-shirt. Look and at I Fat thought, Albert eating that big sandwich. Oh, it's it. my sandwich shop. It's He's eating the Joe's, Joe's sandwich shop. Joe's sandwich shop. Yeah, just put you out of business. He's yeah, like, hey, I got diabetes. <laughs> I'll have all the meat. <laughs> Give me all the ham. Hey, hey. <laughs> there you go. All right, can we name all the Cosby kids? Uh, here's the bottle. Oh, wait, we forgot. There's. There's oh Donald, Mushmouth, and uh, and Rudy. Rudy, Dumb Donald. Playing. Dumb Donald, too, right? Yeah, Dumb Donald, oh, Mushmouth, you know. and, and Rudy playing Marbles. The marbles was huge in the 70s. Here they are playing. I guess they couldn't have them show them shooting, shooting dice. Here they are playing the game, uh, I think that's called Buck Buck. The yeah, one. that is Buck Buck, where they would Buck leap Buck. over stuff. It was basically yeah. leap wrong. Yeah. So there you go. Fat out. Now, let's see what's inside. There's definitely something in here. There's some heft to this. Ooh. There's a thermos. There is a thermos. Is there, some, is there something some in here? Bubble tape. There's something in oh, the bubble something tape. Else, something else in the bubble tape. I think this is a surprise. From... Oh my lord! It's Quaaludes! We did not set this up! This is this is totally Lisa's doing. She put Quaaludes in the lunchbox. You gotta do one of those things when you promote it, like, you won't believe what we found! <laughs> You There's win. There's actually some kind of pills in there, too. She went out. Oh, man. Actual quaaludes. <laughs> They're Altoids. <laughs> They're Altoids. <laughs> she went above and beyond, oh. though, because it's full of pills. It's like... Oh, my Lord. I can't oh. believe she did that. That's amazing. <laughs> that is amazing. Oh, it's so good. And here's here's the thermos in here that you can put the quaaludes, the quaaludes in. in give, give, give you a... Give, <laughs> if you're at lunch, yeah. here, have a drink with my thermos. There's, there's quaaludes in there. So there you go. Oh, it's so good. Should we give uh, the thermos the, the old smell test? I don't know if I want to. I'm afraid I might pass out and so, wake up with my pants on the... <laughs> oh, surprisingly clean. Yeah, that's it's like that, that has that same thermos like, smell. There was like a they unique, cleaned the evidence out. Unique to the thermos of a lunchbox quality smell that sometimes pops up. Oh, yeah. man. Let me see, let me see. I'm still getting that over this. Really oh, my gosh. That is. Yeah. 
That is great. You got to keep that with that. Oh yeah. This is this is wonderful. Look at that. I love I love that it's got the whole gang on the back and they're they're playing their wacky instruments. Absolutely. So can you name everybody? See if you. Can you okay. Name, let's see if I can see name everyone. Let's see. What are, oh, are they on the front or? Well, let's check out the back. I think everybody's on the. All right, we've got. Uh, I'll go for. I'll put in a nice little shot here so you can see what we're looking at. Rudy. Rudy. That's um, Mushmouth. That's oh, Russell. Russell, right? Bill. Bill. Fat Albert. Um, that was Bill's brother, right? What was Bill's brother's name? He had this crazy eye, right? Well, his brother was Russell. Oh. Well, Oh, so who's that? Who no, that? No, that's Weird Harold. Weird Harold. Oh, Weird Harold. Weird Harold. Okay. Um, that's that's Dumb Donald, and this guy here is Bucky. Yes. Yeah. The Winter Soldier. Yeah. <laughs> and of course, Fat Albert. I can't believe I almost forgot Weird Harold. Weird Harold. Yeah. He had the crazy eyes. Yeah. There we yeah, go. Right, did we look did at all sides? Did, did Cosby have a brother named Russell? He did. In real life. Yeah. Hmm. Yep. So there we go. Fat Albert, complete with. We were there playing like, you know, go karts, and uh, oh man, this is this might be the best yet. You, you win, this, Lisa. This you is, win. This is up there with with the Gil Gerard talking about cornhole. Uh, late great tweaky. What a way to come back. We don't do one for a while. We come back. We get we get we come back quaaludes. <laughs> I feel it's necessary to really stress we did not plan that. She she got us on that one. That no. was a total surprise. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's so good. That's so good. So uh, there we got have it. Uh, Voyage to the bottom of the sea. Uh -huh. Fat Albert and the Cosby Kids, both from uh, Lisa Soars. Uh, we appreciate it, Lisa. Thank you. Thank you for the quaaludes. And. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna slip some of those quaaludes into his drink, and uh, duck, things are gonna get crazy. Why is the duck on there? I don't know. There is a duck. There's a duck on top as he's buck bucking over Russell. Yeah. Bill is buck bucking Russell. Maybe he told Russell to duck, and that duck came by. Huh. I don't know. There you go. Well, came back strong. Yep. All right. All right, so uh, you everybody. Tell them where the folly and all that stuff. Yeah, the, the if, if they got there here, they know, don't they? But yeah, now you find Mega Pontastic everywhere Mega Pontastic Twitter, Mega Pontastic Facebook, Mega Pontastic on Instagram. And uh, ever loving paprika shirts, t shirts coming soon. Yeah. Oh, you have that new t shirt coming of your Toyota, right? The Toyota? I think your Toyota, uh, just your, here's my RAV4 t-shirt. Don't you have that? Oh, I thought you meant the t-shirt of... Oh, that's a Toyota. My Toyota. Yeah, that's a Toyota. <laughs> <laughs> you do have this nice uh, Star Wars Holiday sp uh, Special throw pillow. Yes, oh, that was you <laughs> originally a t-shirt. Throw <laughs> pillow with personality. Mm -hmm. All right, well... Where can everyone find you? So, did we say that already? Uh, Monogog. They can find. They can also find you sometimes riding the uh, the train around Disneyland. Right? Riding around the train around Disneyland. Yeah. Yeah. People wearing my shirts. Yeah. All right. Yeah. yeah. Keep wearing those. Oh no, that's not what we say on this show. We say keep keep eating those ding dongs. Keep eating those ding dongs. God, it's been a while. I forgot what we say. Watch out for the quaaludes. Keep eating those ding dongs. Keep keep slipping those quaaludes. Rudy. Uh, all right. All right. <laughs> Bye. Keep wearing those pajamas with the plastic feet. Keep wearing those pajamas. Tell everyone you need. Keep wearing those pajamas with the back door flap. Keep wearing those pajamas. Don't open it to trap. Some people call them bitches, some people call them jammies They can come embroidered with big money and no whammies They can have a hundred tiny commander and damas But no matter how they look, just keep on wearing those pajamas Keep on wearing those pajamas Keep wearing those pajamas And now we're having fun Keep wearing those pajamas And now the song is done